We've got an MX5400 HST open station here. We're going to go ahead and start off with the same weight that we finished up with the L4701, which is 2,262 and one half pound. Uh, we're going to start out with this, see what it does. Got it up seven feet three inches with 262 and a half pounds on there. It's pretty good. Okay, so we just uh, took off a half of one of our smaller weights here, added two more of our bigger ones. Now we're up to 2,420 pounds. Uh, let's see what this one's got. Alright, so we added a couple more weights on the front of this bad boy here. Now we're at 26.55 and a half. So uh, let's just see what it's going to do. So we added a couple more weights up front. Um, now we're sitting, sitting about 2,895 pounds right now. Before we lift this, we're gonna touch on this weight box back here. It's very, very important that when you start lifting this kind of weight off the front of these tractors that you have a substantial amount of weight on the back. Right now, we're probably sitting about 1,300 pounds inside the weight box. And on the last one, I could feel the tires on the back getting a little bit light. So for safety, if you start getting this kind of weight up here on any of the tractors, it's important to have weight off the back. On the, if you're in a subcompact, you know, a rototiller or something will probably be suffice. You get up into these MX tractors, these 60 plus horse tractors, uh, you're going to want some substantial weight on the back just for safety caution. So if you lift it up, you don't nose yourself right over. Uh, but let's give this one a shot, 2,895 pounds, uh, let's see how high we're going to get. So, you know, that's plenty high enough to get it moving around the yard, you know, do what you need to do. 
we're, we're putting a lot of weight off the front of this thing. Uh, we're probably going to add two more weights to the front just to see, uh, you know, we can get it a little bit off the ground to see if we're moving around at least a little. All right, we added a couple more weights on the front of this bad boy here. So now we're at 3,130.8 pounds. 3,130.8. Uh, let's see if it'll get it off the ground at least. We're going to pull one weight off and uh, see if that'll get it. Now we're at 3,012 pounds, 3,012 and a half pounds, so let's see if this goes off. One foot. So a little over 3,000 pounds, got a one foot off the ground. That's uh, that's pretty good considering, again, we are way out past the 19.7 inches forward of that pin. So pretty good for that MX5400.